Hi, and welcome to Upcycled Art at Home. I am Mr. Corey. I'm Miss April. And today we're going to show you a couple upcycled art activities that you can do for preschoolers, kids, um, and teens. So it's a lot of fun um, stuff you can do with paint. Um, so for example, we're going to do, um, I have here some eggs and we're going to roll them and create an abstract painting here in uh, this box. Now you don't have to have like a box like this if you have like a, a shoe box or even like a deep dish. Uh, that'll work to, for, to put your paper in. Uh, so we're going to start with some paint. And you're just going to pour a little bit of paint, different colors in. Okay. And if you don't have um, plastic eggs like this, any um, round object that like rolls, like if you have like marbles or a small ball, anything like that will be good. So you're gonna put your objects in your box and then you're gonna roll them around a bit. And... Doesn't wanna get in the blue. No, you gotta <laughs> get that blue. It's kind of like pinball. Yeah, right? <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> And like you said, you can really use any object that'll roll. These will clean really easily, so that's a good um, advantage to using the plastic. Definitely, yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I mean, I think it looks cool. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to show you what I got. And here is your finished piece. So there you go. So this is one upcycle craft you can do, and Miss mm -hmm. April's going to show you another one. Yeah, so I have a few objects here. I'm just going to move the paint out of the way. Um, I've got just a sheet of paper, any size will do. Um, and I have a fruit cup. This is a lid to a yogurt, I think. A pudding cup, just some regular plastic cups. Paper towel or toilet paper rolls. Um, you can also use like Legos. Um, Duplos work really well for this. Um, I even busted out some of the eggs too. And we're actually just going to do stamping with these. So um, I have a paper plate that I'm using for my palette. And we're just going to put some paint on there. And this is actually a great way to talk about shapes too, shapes and colors, um, especially if you're doing this with your younger kids. Yeah. Um, if you're doing with your older kids, I think they'll just sort of like um, getting to make the different prints. So the good thing about something like this pudding cup is it's gonna make two different shapes. So you can um, dip in the paint and print right, stamp right on the page. So now we have a square, but if we turn it over, we can also make a circle. So that's pretty cool. Um, I love doing the Lego Duplos. Um, Lego, regular Legos will work too. Even the bigger um, big blocks will work because they create this really cool bubble pattern, which is a lot of fun. And they clean up pretty easily. Um, you can make little circles with your eggs like that. Um, and I wonder what, I wanna see this one. This is something we can try too. You could dip it in more than one color, kind of give it a twist around and then maybe print it, and now you have like sort of a rainbow look yeah, to it, which neat. I like that. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. So, got our lovely paper towel roll. I think we'll do another one of those. So, there you go. So, that's basically all there is to it. You can make your own fun art and um, let them dry and have art projects display around the house. Yeah, definitely. So, this has been Upcycled Art with Miss April. And, and Ms. Corey. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.